Hi everybody, it's Trish here from Pinky's Farm and happy Tuesday. I am here not on a Friday, but on a Tuesday to share with you a collab that I have um, underway with Jen from Today and Jen's Sewing Room, Carol from Sew Carol, Adam from Adam Sews, and Andra from Andra Makes. Of course, I'm going to link all their channels below. But we uh, got together and decided to do a collab. This is our second collab of these, what we call the Fab Five. This is our second collab. Um, the first one you may recall was our mushroom collab. And I will leave a link to that below as well, to my mushroom collab. And you can see, go to all their channels and you can see the mushroom collab and what everyone made. So we decided this time, the next person on the list to pick a theme was Jen from Today and Jen Sewing Room. And of course, those who know Jen very well also know that she loves space, anything space related, even sci-fi space, reality space, anything on the theme of space she loves. And so she decided that that was gonna be her choice for our collab this time. And you know, Jen, I think you picked it, or did we just pick it for you? Honestly, I can't remember. But either way, our theme this time is space. And so, for my portion of the collab today, I have a little sweatshirt to show you. This was made from Quick Sew $25.95. I made this view here <laughs> with the girl with the sticker on her head. Um, I bought this pattern, as you can see, for $0.25 cents at a thrift store. And it's just a little zip front popover hoodie. Not a hoodie. It's just a little popover jacket. Here's the line drawings. Super simple. But this is the first time I've used a quick sew, one of these older quick sew patterns. And I have to say, it went really well. It was easy. Um, the pattern instructions were very good. And this popped together just really quickly. I was a little nervous about the zipper working correctly, but all turned out well. So let me just show you some of the details about my little space zip up jacket. Oh, I see my cat getting into the program. Uh, you're blocking my jam here. Excuse me. Okay, that was Rollo. Um, so, I made the top section of this out of just a blue stretch that came from Joanne Fabrics. The bottom is a black French terry also from Joanne Fabrics. And it's a really good weight for here in Florida because I don't get many opportunities to wear like a little zip up like this um, over kind of like outerwear. Uh, just maybe sometimes spring, early spring, fall, winter, that would be about it. So, um, but I really wanted to be able to use this Artemis patch right here. Now, back in the fall, you may recall that Jen came to visit me and we went at midnight out to the Kennedy Space Center and we sat and watched the Artemis One launch and um, we had a great time. We just made memories, enjoyed sitting out there together, watching all the people, watching the launch and um, it was just something special to the two of us and um, I just wanted to kind of remember that by using this little patch that was the Artemis patch. So I ordered that off of Amazon. It came right away and I just thought it would be a nice addition to this little zip up. Um, I've just been really happy with this pattern and it happens just to be a cool enough day today that I can actually put this on without sweating to death. Um, here's the back. It has a split hem. As you can see, it's slightly longer in the back than it is in the front. I like that, especially when the weather is cool. I like to have a lot of coverage. So it covers the entire booty which is good. And um, the only thing missing from this is definitely pockets. The pattern does not call for pockets. There are no patch pockets, no kangaroo pocket. That is something that I will be adding to this because it just needs, you can't wear outerwear that doesn't have pockets on it. Just, that doesn't make sense, does it? Um, so I'm gonna be putting a kangaroo pocket or some side seams, but most likely a kangaroo pocket on the front of this just to finish it, finish the look and the functionality of it. So I am really happy with this. 
Now, I hope that every one of you will go immediately down to my description box and click on the, t the links to everyone else's channel so that you can see what they made. That's what I'm going to be doing because we all have delivered this video at the exact same time of day and everyone will have something different which we have not seen. None of us have seen what each other is doing so it's going to be a big surprise to all of us and it's just really fun to see what do people think of when they think of space. Um, when I think of space, I think of my career out at the Space Center here in, I live near the Space Center in Florida. I worked for Lockheed Martin. I worked for United Launch Alliance. I worked on their launch programs. And um, so to me, I always go straight back to my career in the space industry. So this will always remind me of that. And it'll always remind me of Jen coming over to just share in that experience with me. But, you know, for each person the word space means something different. So it's just going to be, sorry, I'm fiddling with that. It's just going to be interesting to see what everybody comes up with in their version of a space themed item. Could be a garment, could be a craft, who knows? It, we don't really have any huge rules and regulations when we do these collabs. All right, folks, I hope you like my space themed little zip up with my Artemis patch, there's the rocket right there, heading to the moon. Moon's in the background. And um, let's go now and check and see what everybody else made, okay? All right, bye. I'll see you on Friday.